Hi Trombones, thanks for tuning in. Today, we're going to be working out of our Accent Book 1, page number 12. On this page, we've got eighth notes, and we see those eighth notes in that blue box in the upper left-hand corner. Eighth notes receive half of a beat in 2-4 and 4-4 time. We count eighth notes 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and. The tempo marking in the purple box is a term andante, and it means a moderately slow tempo. In the red box, we learn a variation is when we change the rhythm of the notes of a theme to create some variety. So changing the rhythm or notes of a theme to create some variety. Let's get started with our first exercise, the eighth note express. So this one counts like this. One, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, rest. One, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, four. Give it a try on your trombone. One, two, ready, begin. How did you do? If you made some mistakes, go back and try it again. You want to make sure that you're building accuracy with every exercise. Next up is the rhythm riddle. It says clap first, then play. Let's clap. One, two, ready, go. One, two, and one, two. One, and two, one, two. Rest, two, and one, two, one, two, one, two. Remember that a tie joins two notes together to make one longer note. So those two quarter notes that are tied together Get two beats like a half note. Let's try playing it. One, two, ready, go. Next up is the Bile Them Cabbage Down American Fiddle Tune. Notice at the end of this song, there's a repeat symbol. We'll play it twice. So play through line 34 two times with me. Let's get ready and play some eighth notes. Ready? One and two, and here we go. <laughs> Make sure you have your D in fourth position. Next up is the Surprise Symphony, and this is where our variation comes into play. You see, the first line of number 35 is the theme from Franz Joseph Haydn's piece, but lines two and three are a variation because some of the notes and rhythms are changed to create variety. Here we go. And one, two, ready, play. Uh, uh, uh. 
to rewind and replay that one again as many times as you need to make progress. Remember, we're trying to build our accuracy on each and every exercise. Next up is the accent on creativity, variation on lightly row. Here, you're gonna use a pencil and it says create your own variation by changing some of the quarter notes into pairs of eighth notes. So like they did in the first measure where they changed one of the quarter notes D into a pair of eighth note Ds. Let's play through number 36 before you put your variation. One, two, ready, go. Now grab a pencil and write in your variation and then try and play it and see what it sounds like. Everybody will have a slightly different variation which makes this exercise a whole lot of fun. Remember to play it for someone so that they can hear your work with the theme and variation. So until I see you in our next video, keep practicing.